Welcome to Whitney's channel. Hi guys, hi, my name is Whitney Wiley and welcome to my channel. I am doing a Urban Outfitters spring haul today. So I recently did a misguided haul and it seemed to go over really well. You guys seem to like it. So thank you for everyone who did watch it and left feedback because that really helped. It allowed me to understand what people are liking and know what else to make for the future videos. So I decided to do an Urban Outfitters haul because I've been doing a lot of shopping there recently. Um, I used to shop there quite a bit a few years ago and then I stopped for some reason and I just rediscovered Urban Outfitters. So I got a lot of cute things um, that I think would be really great for the summer, pool parties, barbecues, just casual summer everyday looks. So I wanted to share them with you guys. This is a try on haul so I'm going to try on everything so you can see how it fits on me and I'll let you know what size I got. And also I will link all the products down below. So if you are interested in something, then I'll leave a link so you can easily find it. And yeah, let's get started with the haul. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. I make videos once or twice a week. So if you enjoy the video and would like to see more of them, just hit the subscribe button down below or the little bell notification and you'll be notified every time I put up a new video. All right, let's get started. Okay, so first thing I picked up were some basic bodysuits. You know, bodysuits are all the rage this year. Um, they've come back in style, and I just felt like I needed some casual bodysuits that I could wear every day and not just to wear out. But this is the first one that I'm wearing. It just looks like a regular tee. Um, the camera's kind of washing it out, but it's the seafoam green color. Excuse me, it's a seafoam, why can't I say that? It is seafoam green. <laughs> It's a sea foam green color um, and it's really, really comfortable. It's just a basic tee. These are very, very comfortable. I love how easy they are just to pop on with jeans or with black pants or something like that. So I believe I paired this with black pants in the video and some heels, but you can obviously just throw this on with like jean shorts and you know, whatever, head out to a barbecue. But I got this in a size small and I got two shades. So I got the seafoam green shade and then I got this like charcoal gray as well. So I got both of them. They kind of have like that washed look already. And just so you know, because like I said in my misguided video, they never mention on the sites whether they're full briefs or thong bottoms what they are this is a full brief so just so you know um obviously that's annoying when you're wearing you know tight pants or a skirt or something where your underwear could potentially show just so you know these are loose enough that you can kind of cheat and make them a thong fyi that's maybe what i do so uh these work both ways um because they have this very stretchy material so i love both of these i've already worn this one like twice i think okay the next thing i got is a t-shirt that is quite out of the ordinary for me i don't wear too many graphic tees and with that i don't wear too many i'd say rocker inspired tees so here he is <laughs> here is the top it's got a bald eagle on the front and then the back has two tigers which kind of give me a little bit of the ed hardy feel i don't know does anybody remember that um but they kind of have this like ed hardy feel to them minus the rhinestones thank god we're done with the rhinestones but i really love this tee because it's a deep deep v-neck and then it has that like so it has like a cheap choker collar so it looks like you're wearing a choker and necklace when you're wearing this and i think these look really cool if you layer them with like little dainty necklaces that come down past the choker part and come down into the v so i really really like this um just for our everyday t-shirt it just has a little more of an edgier vibe and I picked up this one actually in an extra small. Um, they didn't have a small, but I think it fits pretty well. So um, it fits me perfectly. So I probably won't throw this in the dryer when I wash it because I don't want it to shrink because it just fits perfect. So uh, it does run a little bit big because I definitely would normally wear a small. So I got this in an extra small and it still fits really well. Okay, the next top I got is just a simple basic. This is a charcoal gray v-neck tee and it has a very wide opening here you can wear this a little like off the shoulders if you want to kind of pull it to one side just very comfortable as you can see it's thin material which is perfect for summer so it's going to be very breathable um i got this in a size 
extra small as well it runs very very big so you'll see on me even though it's extra small it's still really slouchy but I really really like this just for an everyday t-shirt um, I wanted to pick up a lot of basics from Urban Outfitters because for some reason my eye always gravitates towards like sparkly shiny like night out type of items um, and I have to remind myself like you need just regular shirts to go to a barbecue in. Yeah, so I really, really like this one. It's very, very soft, very, very comfy. So I think this is worth a buy if you just need some everyday basics. Okay, so the next top I picked up, I've worn once before as well. And I really, really like this one. It is a t-shirt and it has a little crisscross detail in the V-neck part. So it kind of adds that little detail there. So you probably don't need to wear um, a statement necklace or anything like that. You can get away with like dainty jewelry with this. Um, but this is in a charcoal gray shade. I got it in a size medium. Um, once again, it's really, really soft fabric, super comfortable t-shirt. So I probably could have gotten away with a small, but I feel like the medium still fits pretty well. And um, the baggy look is kind of in. So, you know, why not have a couple of shirts that are a little tighter, a little more form fitting, and then a little, um, a couple shirts that are a little more baggy that you can just use to like tuck in and slouch around in. Okay, so the next two items I got were crop tops. I wanted to get some type of crop top situation that I could wear with high-waisted pants um, or high-waisted shorts or anything like that that I could throw over a bathing suit. When I saw this, I fell in love! <laughs> Okay, so here she is. So cute. She looks a little crazy holding her up, but I'll insert that clip, of course. All I thought of was Beyonce Lemonade. I mean, it was just so cute, so springy. I know they have this top in a few other, I think like two other prints and colors, but I just love the lemons. I thought it was so perfect for spring. Um, I love that it has the crisscross detailing in front. So if you've ever had like a wrap shirt or wrap dress, you know that makes your chest look really good. You can dress it down with like a pair of Converse or something like that or you can go all out like I did and put it with you know a pair of high-waisted pants and high heels and blah 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 and I got this in a size oh it comes in a size medium large so it's either small or I think it was actually I believe I saw an extra small small and then a medium large so I got this in a medium large because I feel like I needed the space up top okay next crop top I got is this little pink one and it's so cute. It looks like it's for a baby on here. <laughs> but it stretches. It stretches a lot. But I love this little pink top. It has a little ruffle detailing on the top and bottom. It's super simple tube top. And I got this in a size medium large again. Um, but this I thought would be so cute with a pair of high-waisted shorts. If you wore this over like a bikini or a bandeau top and wore this to the pool or um, to the beach, just walking around. I thought this was perfect for spring and summer. I figured I would get a lot of use out of this because it's just so easy to dress up or dress down. So the next thing I got was a pair of denim shorts. Okay, so I got these denim shorts. They're in a light wash. They're just dressed on the bottom. They have like a few holes all around them. From the back, this is what they look like. And I have jean shorts already, but I have like some super cheeky jean shorts um, that are perfect for, you know, wearing over a swimsuit or wearing to the beach, something like that. So I wanted some jean shorts where I was completely covered, but still cute. Like I didn't want them down to my knees, obviously, but I just wanted ones that if I wanted to go, you know, hang out with my parents, whoever, grandma, like you could wear these shorts and uh, nothing was poking out. Oh, also let me mention, these are not that stretchy. So if you're looking for a stretchy pair, they're not super stretchy. They have they have a little give in them um, because I, I always have to have a little bit of stretch because I have a smaller waist area and then bigger butt problem. So then I always have that gapping in the back. But these fit pretty well even though they aren't super stretchy. Okay, so the next thing I got was an embellished belt. I've been wanting an embellished belt for probably a year now. Um, I remember these came out, our belts started coming out last summer with like the double buckles. But I wanted something with like quite a bit of hardware on it. So I found this one at Urban Outfitters. It's kind of got this Western style and I wanted all gold accents because I only wear gold jewelry. I rarely wear silver. So I thought this one was really cool. It just had these like, gold accents all over it 
Um, it's just a Western style belt and it's very, very heavy duty. The material is very, it's a very high quality material. So it just buckles like this, just so you can see what the front looks like. I really, really like this. I feel like it'll be something that I keep for quite a while. I'm really impressed with the quality actually of this belt. So I was gonna get some that I figured were gonna be a little bit cheaper in quality. But uh, when I saw this one, I was like, okay, I feel like this is gonna be something that I'll be able to keep for quite a while. And I usually wear my belts out. Like I don't get another belt until I've worn the other one out and I wear them for years and years and years. I got this one in a size medium. Okay, that's the last of the clothing items, but I picked up a couple of beauty items at Urban Outfitters. You know, they kind of have that like beauty section with makeup and hair essentials. So I wanted to show you guys what I got. Um, the first thing and favorite thing that I got from the beauty section is this Lot de Coco Shimmering Body Oil. So let me put it up close so you can see it. Look at this baby. Oh, I can't even handle it. Yeah, I saw this and I thought the packaging was just super, super cute. And I wanted to get some type of like shimmering body oil to put on my Deglate area for the summer when you go out to the pool or the beach and you just want to add a little extra oomph, you know what I mean? Sure, I figured this was perfect. And I love this little container. It has a little dropper situation so you won't have oil. You don't have to do that poor thing and oil is going everywhere and you're wasting half your oil. I don't know if anyone's ever had a bottle like that before. But let me show you guys what this looks like. So let me put it on. Like, I'm gonna put two drops on my hand and then rub it in. Oh my gosh, and it smells so good. It smells like coconut tropical paradise. It just smells like you're on vacation. So there we go. So it just adds so much glisten and gleam to your skin. Just to compare, this hand does not have any body oil on it and then this one does but I just love how pretty this makes your skin and how good it smells it just smells like heaven and this oil is not too heavy it's a pretty light oil so it absorbs pretty fast you're not just gonna be a grease ball rolling around in the sand with sand all stuck to you okay so the last two things I got were for my hair I just got an essential that um, I'm restocking on so this is the Baptiste I can never say their name Baptiste dry shampoo plus and this is the hint of color in Divine Dark. I'm sure you've seen dry shampoo plenty of times before, Baptiste, but it's hard to find the ones with a hint of color in it with a darker shade. So I wanted this because it was dark brown. I knew it would blend easily with my hair and I don't use this on my natural hair. I use this on my weave hair or any extensions that I have. And I just like to do it because it adds texture and adds like a little bit of body to my hair. It also, my weave or my extensions are ever oily because I have oiled my own personal hair or oiled my scalp then this kind of helps um, just get those areas that just got like a little too much oil on them so you know how this starts looking stringy with too much oil whereas your own hair actually needs the oil so anyway I picked up this this is just a repurchase and then lastly I got this which was so funny because I haven't seen this brand in quite a while but I got the mane and tail detangler for your hair and I had to get this just because my mom used to use mane and tail on my hair when I was little and I don't know why we stopped using it. I don't know why, yeah, I, I, I don't know. But anyway, I never see it in stores anymore and I know you can pick it up probably on like Amazon or eBay. Um, I just saw this in store and I was like, okay, I've never used the detangler so I know it's specialized for coarse hair, thick hair, um, made for horses, I believe. I thought this could really, really help detangle tight and coarse hair. So I wanted to try this out on my own hair. All right, guys, so that is it for my video. That's everything that I picked up at Urban Outfitters. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, once again, all the products are listed down below. So if you want to pick up anything, I put the links down there so you can check them out. Um, and thanks again for watching my video and making it to the end. I really appreciate it. And comment down below if you like this style video. So I'm taking all suggestions in so if you did enjoy this definitely let me know because I already know what I want to do for my next haul video if you like this one don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video and I will see you in my next one all right bye guys